it is starting for your viewing pleasure. So let's do this. Oh, you gotta love you gotta love the uh, start sequence there. I probably messed up the date in there, but that's okay. I probably might want to go back and uh, re-edit that, but that's okay. Fire Emblem Warriors. The cycle of this world. I will not allow it to perish with you. <laughs> okay, I'm not a Fire Emblem person. I seek to destroy the irrational power structure that shackles Fodlin. If the kingdom is ever to part ways with our bloody past, this is the path we must walk. I have ambitions, okay. Edelgard. Real ones. I'm kind of, I mean, I'm happy for the people who like this, but... Will you sit around and Wait, is this a like... Miracle? Or will you help me seize control Is this a sequel? Feet? Is this like a sequel or is this DLC? Because I've never seen like the we same fight. concept. We shall survive and we shall win a glorious future for Fodlin. But now that I know, I won't make the same mistake again. So yeah, this is like first half of 2022. Revenge is not a thing you take for someone else. You seek revenge to slake your rage and heal your wounded heart. I know you are prepared to do whatever that you must. June 24th. Hello, everyone. Well, this is kind of bad for me, though, because I be your guide for today's half ass countered picked this in my critically like an unannounced Fire Emblem game, and now I'm going to pay the price. The Fire Emblem God damn it! <laughs> Fucking damn it. Hope you'll look forward to a oh, I knew this shit was gonna happen to me. But whatever. Hey, I'm happy for the people that are enjoying this. Like, that Let's wanted the, the uh, game to uh, come out. Alright, so. What do we have? First batch. The Orange Star Nation needs you. We've got more intel on the Advance Wars 1 Plus 2 Reap Boot Camp game. In the first yeah, this campaign, is Game Masters, Wars, like, right up his alley here. will a colorful cast of commanding officers and use their abilities in vibrant turn-based battles. Each commanding officer is now forced, bringing even more Jake! Jake out. Lester! What is going on, dude? Thank you so much for the raid. Not me forgetting to uh, turn off my uh, notifications, but, uh... Normally, thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for the raid. Normally, I would play the raid, uh, the raid hype notification, but um, right now this is kind of a different story. We are reacting to the Nintendo Direct live, so thank you so much for the raid, Jake. If you haven't followed Jake Lester, go check him out. Awesome dude. I kind of forgot to turn notifications off, but that's okay. I, um, you got, you forgot the underscore. I forgot the underscore, Wars, Lucy. Reboot camp. Marches onto the Sending Nintendo people Switch to watch the Nintendo April Direct. 8th. Well, you're awesome, dude. You're awesome. Now on Nintendo e April 8th. Okay, well, at least we got a release date for that. Explore an infinite universe. Yeah, let me know if you guys can hear the volume okay. Yeah, In so, no uh... Sky. Shio Garats, I see you. Mr. Yeah, Mr. Sun. OCD Lady. Let me say hi to everybody. Each orbited um, HG Arrest, how is everybody doing? Travel to planets Good to see everybody from Jake's Raid. Usually universe. I would try, introduce myself, Here, but you guys know who I am. You know what I'm about. And creatures Jake's raided this channel before. And may never be seen again. To survive, you must craft your own tools and even your own place to live. In this living and breathing universe, trade good. Okay. travel awesome. between stars. Factions vie for territory. Pirates hunt unwary what travelers. Kind of mass effect. Like and the authorities are this. ever watchful. Your journey may be fraught with danger. Or maybe I just maybe this game just was released Trader. a while back and I just don't even Fire. know it. Explorer. How will you live in this universe? I don't know. I'm not in that no universe. Oh, it is no man. Okay, so I, well, I, I, good, I didn't see the game because um, because of uh, Jake's raid. Ah! 
Oh, what it is this strikers? It's freaking strikers. Oh my god. Yo. <laughs> A Mario soccer game is back. Oh, Donkey Kong. You maniac. Oh, super strikers. Ooh, that animation looks pretty clean. That animation looks actually pretty badass. Mario Strikers Battle League. I see. For strike, a five-on-five sport like soccer that's way heavy on offense. Aim for goals by dribbling and passing to teammates, as well as Yo, that actually looks pretty, pretty awesome. Items. The funny thing is, I never played a Mario Strikers game, but this would actually look cool. The main rule in this sport is to rule the field. Try to score more goals than your opponents. There are two things to keep in mind that'll help you with your strategies. First, all right, you gotta hang with the wife and catch me. All right, Jake, no problem, man. Thank you so much for the raid, dude. You are absolutely amazing. Like I said, Jake Lester. Well, check him out on Twitch. Customize as you see fit. Second, oh, you can actually customize hyper strike to activate this shot. Grab an orb when it appears on the field and charge it while your opponents are distracted. Ooh. Hit the net, and you'll score not one but two goals. Oh, geez, Beavis got nothing on this. Eight Four players on each so, team ooh, you can actually play on Ooh, this one one might be something I would be interested system. in getting because, like I said, I've never played one of these. In addition before. to individual matches, online play will have an online club mode. Join online club, club mode and compete for placement in the rankings. Up to 20 players can join a club, so create your own and invite friends and family to play alongside you. Or oh, for ultimate family and friendship players. enders. Try to become the world's top club. Well, imagine With that. Items, tackles and hyper strikes. Anything goes on this field. Mario Strikers Battle June 10th. launches on Nintendo Switch June 10th. June 10th, Pre ladies and gentlemen. On Nintendo e or we could team the up, you never know. Just the depends. Mario Strikers series is coming to Nintendo Switch. We hope be fun for the Pug family. <laughs> game. Well, it might be a good idea for uh, this. community nights for uh, Saturday nights. Up, sir. Oh, we got Splatoon. Is this number three? Ooh, I kind of like that entrance, so you just... Just fly off like that. Oh, this, oh, this is a wave. Oh, you can team up with people in, like, waves and such. Okay. I'm sorry, what? Oh, okay. Oh, please spare me, Rick Ashley. I wasted all my money on OnlyFans. <laughs> Vietnam years. Yo, thank you for the 10 minutes. The, Viet the, Viet the, Viet the Vietnam years. Kind of looks like that a little bit. Flipper flopper. You're gonna get flip flopped. Gonna get flip flopped, son. Oh, yeah, wrecking ball. Shout out to Hammond and uh, making an appearance in uh, Splatoon. <laughs> Oh. I legit thought they were about to play the Final Fantasy Victory theme. I was like, wait a minute, that's copyright. <laughs> 
Salmon Run. Taking place in Seattle, Washington. That was the trailer for the co-op mode in the Splatoon 3 game, the next wave of Salmon Run. A giant salmonid, one that's never been seen before, was also spotted at the end of the trailer. Will the Inklings and Octolings ink or swim? Splatoon 3 Just will swim. this summer. We hope you'll look Just swim. To future updates. It's only in the uh, Pacific Ocean. You'll be fine. Let's move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. Fonzers at the ready. What am I looking at here? Titanfall? What an, oh, full never mind. The first front mission game is storming. That literally looked like Titan. Switch. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> In this, this was not what I was uh, looking at. <laughs> machines called Vanzers and lead your exactly, to Lucy. Victory. I hundred a thousand percent agree with that. Yeah, Gain we we eating good in uh, 2022. Parts to destroy. Mix so this is like tight RPG Titanfall. Kind of. Uncover the great storyline of this classic when Front That's what it One looks Remake like. launches on Nintendo Switch this summer. And in the future, the sequel, Front Mission 2 Remake. Starcraft will also looks weird. Nintendo yeah, it kind of does. It's like a mix of that and uh, Titanfall, kind of a little bit. If it was Get RPG. Set for a high octane Disney and Pixar combat racer. Wait, what the hell? Disney From the race of the asphalt series comes rip roaring racing action across Disney and Pixar inspired racetracks. Mario this Kart who <laughs> high speed circuits using each one's special abilities to battle for victory across the finish line. Choose Mickey Mouse for symphonic speed, Sully for monstrous power, or Mulan for explosive maneuvers. I can't believe I just each said that. Each also possesses powerful ultimate skills. Perfect for turning the tables at the last second. Disney Speedstorm is a free-to-play game with new seasons added regularly. It's always a free-to-play. Exciting Disney and Pixar characters. Free-to-play almost circuits, every single cars, time. And more. Plus, enjoy cross-platform play. Oh, gosh, so you're, uh, I'm gonna go race everybody. Modes. Disney Speedstorm races onto Nintendo Switch this summer. And it's free to play apparently. Dive into these classic franchises on Nintendo Switch. Classic franchises. Unleash the power of the Force in oh. this classic Star Wars action. Oh, adventure. the Force Unleashed. As okay, Darth I haven't Secret played that Princess. in a long time. You use devastating Force powers and lightsaber combos as you hunt down Jedi Masters on iconic. They missed an opportunity to not include Upgrade Benny the Cab. Force that is 100% correct. Then combine them for even more destructive combos. I I used to love this Use game. Button controls or up for motion controls enhanced. From is this the, the PS2 version? version? You can also duel locally the... with a friend to determine who is the galaxy's most powerful. Oh, player. you can actually. Oh, you can Star duel online. Wars, I don't remember even dueling online. Nintendo Switch April twentieth. Pre-orders begin today. I like I like the show. Force Unleashed. That's the actually kind of a nice. Uh, of that was a, that's a good one to Ezio add. I think. Da Frenze awaits in three critically acclaimed Assassin's Creed games. Yeah, Force Unleashed was actually Explore pretty un Renaissance underrated. Italy and 16th century Constantinople. Interact with historical figures and discover secrets of the Creed across three games, two bonus short films, and DLC. Plus, take advantage of enhanced features for the Nintendo Switch system on the go. I think the only Assassin's Creed uh, game I ever played was three. On -screen display. And I think that's on there too. The Ezio Collection launches on Nintendo Switch February 17th. Pilot mobile suits in dynamic action RPG battles. Oh. Strange incidents called another another StarCraft. Uh, <laughs> StarCraft looks weird Find situation. Find out what's causing them <laughs> and restore the proper timeline. You'll lead three mobile suits in battle. Enhance each suit with parts to improve their power. You can also battle uh, uh, pro friends probably and not. No. Multiplayer. Unfortunately. SD Gundam Battle Alliance launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Two worlds cross in the triumphant return of this RPG classic. Well, there's a lot of RPGs. A apparently. remaster of the acclaimed RPG Chrono Cross oh, is coming okay. to the Nintendo Switch system. One fateful day, the protagonist Surge wanders into an alternate world. 
Though okay. it somewhat resembles his home world, he finds that he no longer exists here. How did this happen? You don't exist what is anymore. This mysterious another world. Travel back and forth between both worlds. You don't exist the to the uh, other Over person now. Characters can oh my God! What is that dog? Depending on the choices you make, that dog looks. Will I'm gonna have nightmares and now. The endings that trigger will differ. A number of improvements have been made to this remaster, like the ability to turn off enemy encounters and a newly enhanced Oh, that's not, yeah, that's not broken or anything. Plus, Radical Dreamers, originally released on the Satella view, is included. Experience the origins of Chrono Cross in this text-based adventure. Say, some of the text looks Chrono really, Cross, the Radical Dreamers really dark edition, and sad. Dashes and slashes its way onto Nintendo Switch April 7th. April 7th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Radical Dreamers edition. Oh, okay, well, there's, there's Kirby. Well, Shadow, you got your wish in seeing one. Where'd you guys go? Free Radical? No, not not Free Radical, unfortunately. No. Oh, no! Kirby did not just... No, he didn't just suck... The, he sucked the car! What? Do, oh, that boy's gonna choke on that! Oh, what? What? Well... He just broke all physics there. My boy just swallowed it's an entire car. Unforgettable 3D platforming adventure. Yo, my dude just went and, the land. and then it all right to the car. In mysterious world with an unusual How in the actual? <laughs> the well, this is Kirby we're dealing Kirby with, so I guess anything's adventure. possible when it comes to that, you know, wonderful. Pink blob. Introducing mouthful mode. Oh my god. And they did not the just go there around. with this. Oh my god. A vending machine to attack with juice cans. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, this oh, game is crazy. This is crazy. With my boy looking like a cone head will be the cone heads Kirby, depending on the object he inhales oh my god enjoy light bulb new moves different from copy abilities Kirby I think he is the real threat to society water like this I wouldn't want to meet him in real life and then just have him Kirby move. rescues waddle D's. like waddle if he like swallowed me and grow. just copied More me he'd probably be like me available. like you know taking over the stream At Waddle D's weapon you shop, need the Chevy you know Chase, so this is crazy. <laughs> I'm indeed. <laughs> well, actually, that's. I can, uh. I can probably make that happen somehow. Evolve copy abilities to expand Kirby's range so, of yeah, attacks. I'll probably, like, try to add that next week, though. They'll also change Kirby's like, appearance. I'm in deep. And make him even more powerful. Jeez, Kirby. Kirby is the, uh. He is Some the realest of MVPs here. Stronger involved forms. My boy just, oh my god, he just like <sighs> throwing a flamethrower like he's Charizard up in here. Off. Who are the beasts? Oh my god, what the hell is that thing? What are these enemies trying to do? What the hell is that giant Can kangaroo looking this world? freakish thing? Kirby and the Forgotten Land launches on the Nintendo Switch. System my boy is traveling through a car just. Pre orders are available now. Nintendo eShop. That is nuts. That was Kirby and the Forgotten Land, launching later next month. Please look forward next to its month. release. Let's take a look at some more Nintendo That's some groundbreaking stuff just from a Kirby game, though. Nintendo Direct, Oh, MLB The Show. Shohei Otani. That's right, Otani son. MLB The Show is coming to Nintendo Switch. Yeah, I had that a feeling this was going to be in there like somewhere. Road to the Show and Diamond Dynasty on your Nintendo Switch. But that's not all. Hi. You can even play Exhibition <laughs> with a single Joy-Con controller. With cross-progression, you can also earn and use content on any platform where MLB The Show 22 is available. And take your progress on the go with you 
on Nintendo so you Switch. can, uh, have friends that you play, uh, play handheld with this game. Matches on other consoles, no need to worry. You can invite them and play online. Play online. It's cross-platform. Very groundbreaking. A true two-way player, but this is I was going to say, Statler and Waldorf, what did you get here? But looks like... Looks like those uh, Muppets uh, long lost cousins. You're gonna uh, cousin. have your hands full of games with these collections. Three Kingdom Hearts collections are almost here. From Kingdom Hearts to Kingdom Hearts 3 and the Remind okay. DLC, every entry is oh. coming to Nintendo. I heard they Switch this guy this was like under a lot of fire well for especially the from the demo. Relive or get to know these heart filled Like bad rendering effects and such. Sora, Donald, Goofy, and more. Gorsh, <laughs> Goofy time make an TV, appearance again. Tabletop, or handheld mode. Oh, cool. Kingdom Hearts Integrum Masterpiece for Cloud, containing all three games. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of people that do like this game. Nintendo Switch tomorrow. Oh, it's Each tomorrow. Each collection's cloud version will also be individually available on Nintendo eShop. <laughs> Klonoa is coming to Nintendo Switch. Across dreamy side-scrolling levels, you'll Why have I seen this before? and hover. While firing wind bullets to grab and I think I've enemies. seen this sort of thing somewhere. Use each level surroundings to your advantage. Guess your birthday also, sex will be going crazy. Yeah, I was gonna say you're eating good for your birthday, man. Seriously. Klonoa Fantasy Reverie series launches on Nintendo Switch July 8. Oh, please spare me, Rick Ashley. I wasted all of my money on Nintendo. all the fans. <laughs> We're so glad you're here. Nintendo owes me money for using my like. Come here. <laughs> they should pair you, like, give you like a, a little treat. Twenty percent share of in that. These award-winning <laughs> games. The poor well, thank you for the biddies. Your key to surviving imprisonment in a mysterious lab. Create portals and warp to other areas to find cake? Uh, still unconfirmed. You can pass through portals, and so can cubes, lasers, and robots with unnerving levels of personality. The sequel. This was kind of popular. Local, online. Oh. And I was gonna say. I was gonna say there was. I didn't even know there was a sequel. No lie. Neither is the but yeah, this is the first game was kind of po popular, kind of when portal, back in the day. Companion collection warps onto Nintendo Switch this year. A classic comes alive. Uh oh, a classic. Ooh, okay, hitting them with the piano music. Legend, what? Le okay, I have. This is a legend. Why have I not heard of this? You need Bayonetta 3? Well, Previously yeah, you need all those outside games. Outside of Japan, the RPG Live Alive makes its overseas debut. Now in oh. HD 2D. Multiple stories okay, that's probably why I've never heard of this then. And time periods await. Overseas in Japan. You them is up to you. Prehistory. A tribesman comes of age in a world without words. The Wild West. A wanderer with a bounty on his head fights for his life. Imperial China, a kung fu master searches for a worthy successor. Twilight of Edo, Japan, a shinobi undertakes an important secret mission. Present day, a martial artist strives to become the strongest say, there this ever is was. Very future, medieval. A youth with psychic Never mind. powers takes a stand against evil. It's the past, present, future, and future. A newly built robot is swept the up ghost of Christmas story. past, what Christmas present, and the, the Christmas yet to come. You got the first one, you Live just need two and three. Okay, just to add a kind of long to that collection a little bit. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Doesn't everybody love going back to retro games? How was that? Next up is this. Oh. Uh-oh, that's tennis related. It's a new oh, it's Nintendo Switch series. Sports. We had Wii Sports and now we got Nintendo, Nintendo Switch, Switch Sports. Sports. I was like, wait a minute. Please take a look. Here are the sports included in the Nintendo Switch Sports game. Uh-oh. You might recognize these three from past Wii Sports games. So this is, yeah, this is like, this is Wii, Wii Sports, but on the Nintendo Switch. The right time. Bowling. Oh, Switch Roll Bowling. straight ahead, or give it a little curve. And Chambara. 
Knock your opponent off the platform while attacking and defending. Oh, that guy's Plus, gonna rest in three peace. Three additional sports are joining the lineup. This is kind of a very sports. Soccer. Sp Use a gigantic seen a lot of the sports in this place. direct. Enjoy yeah, we had strikers, MLB the show, and now this. And diving headers. By attaching a Joy-Con controller to the leg strap accessory included with the physical version of the game, you can play shootout mode with intuitive kicking motions. I mean, this, this it looks like something I would Control do. Control your shots like, left and right while keeping the shuttlecock in the air. Basi it's basically Unleashed Wii Sports, but on the Switch. To gain the upper hand. Like I said. Finally, volleyball. Use a Joy-Con controller to serve, bump, set, and spike the ball. Okay. The Just like basic local play with controls. family and friends on one Nintendo Switch system, as well as online play across. Yep, I figured sports. online play was coming. Play against friends online. Survival or bowling. Opt for random matchmaking. The more you win, the tougher the players you'll face. Try taking on this challenge. So basically, bowling battle Since royale. Here, I'd like to show you some gameplay of one of the newly added sports, volleyball. Mr. Takahashi. Oh, hello there, everyone. I'm oh, look at him all decked out from Nintendo. Wow. It looks like it looks like he's about to play a soccer to match. Play. All right, I'll play some volleyball online together with Mr. Koizumi. Do you have your wrist strap ready? Is it really yes, necessary to show more of this gameplay, even though they already showed enough? Around me as well. Yes, we know you're in a green screen. All right, let's start. We'll the guy who was demonstrating showed uh, no emotion. Yeah, he basically had his like his back turned like this, kind right. of. Oh, we're doing this. Uh, volleyball, a newly added sport in Nintendo Switch Sports. What can we expect today? Is it really necessary to team? do that though? It's like... Koizumi to serve with Takahashi up front. We begin with Koizumi serving. How will the opposing team react? Takahashi makes the block. Another one's coming. Again, is this necessary? Koizumi saves it. A setup in the air. I mean, Here a trailer is just enough. This is like the Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy, back. like showing like a little way too much of this. And they score. Takahashi didn't quite get it. I mean, time. it looks fun, all right, but well, it's okay. It's okay. The game's not There's over. no need to show a demonstration. I think serves. we all know how to play, Koizumi especially if you've uh, done Wii Sports. I think we all know. <laughs> right the like this is this is There's completely unnecessary. Another chance. They get the ball. And with a setup from Koizumi, Takahashi scores! They got a point with that fierce spike. Woo! Let's stop our match here. After all, we were in the middle of a presentation. All right. I was gonna I'll say, yeah, please. Now. I mean, just. That was an introduction to Nintendo Switch Sports. I mean, like I said, it's something I probably might get. The game launches April 29th. Ooh, that's actually pretty soon. We're planning a free update in the summer that allows you to play soccer matches with a Joy-Con controller and the leg strap accessory. You can use the accessory to play shootout mode at launch. In soccer addition, actually looks pretty fun. We're also planning a second free update this fall that lets you enjoy golf. Oh. Well, there you go. Now we can... <laughs> we can play golf. Now, Mario Golf Super... Uh, Super Stri... <laughs> well, whatever that new that Mario Golf game was. Online, Mario Golf who? Playtest before <laughs> the game launches to evaluate various technical aspects. <laughs> We'd definitely like to ask for your help with this. The online playtest will only be available for players with an active Nintendo Switch online membership on the dates shown on well, screen. Well, then go help them. For those of you interested, <laughs> go help. please visit the official Nintendo website for more details. Thank you. That's all I have for now about Nintendo Switch Sports. I hope you're looking forward to this game. Let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Oh, more headlines. And then you gotta have the additional one more thing right at the end. Get those Taiko drumming skills ready. Switch Golf Mini Woods, right? The latest <laughs> exactly. The Taiko no game is coming to the Nintendo Switch system. Set in Omiko City, the sacred town for Taiko drums, you'll strive to become a Taiko master. I saw Dashi play this. Kumokun. 
drum to dozens of bopping beats. Dude, he, I saw Dashi play this, and he was messing up so badly. It was so funny. Like, he was getting so mad. And that's not all. I think he was too busy, like, kind of dancing with the beat a little bit. Is included. Uh oh. That's 76 songs total. Plus, take advantage of course there's of gotta be a of course there's gotta be a Zelda song if play. it's uh, coming New to Nintendo have Switch. Also been added for everyone to enjoy. Put on a live concert with up to four players in Donchen Band, or face off against each other in Great Drum Toy War. Toy War. It's a peculiar name. Drum to your heart's content. When Taiko no Tatsujin Rhythm Festival launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Plus, a paid in-game subscription service that gives you access to over 500 songs will be 500. Launch. 500 songs on 60 CDs. What's new with these <laughs> Nintendo Switch games? You get that reference. GG. The brand new tactical RPG game Triangle Strategy is almost Oh, here. that's that's right up Garrett's the alley. Sarah Noah and he's, he was like all hyped about this. In the conflict among three nations. Your choices and conviction will determine their fate. As Lord of House Wolfort, I solemnly swear an oath by which all future lords shall be bound. I will never turn my back on the promise of a better world. A new demo playable to the end of Chapter 3 will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. Prologue demo. The save data from the demo can be transferred to the full game once purchased. Oh. More Cuphead action awaits in the paid DLC oh. Cuphead. Yeah, I, I, I was thinking course. Cuphead was uh, here, coming you'll explore here. Explore a brand new Inkwell Isle. Defeat a bevy of new bosses with wild personalities and even wilder attacks. The clever Miss Chalice is a new playable character. Take down fearsome foes with her double jumps, rolling dodges, and more. Oh. Cuphead, double jumps would be a little bit last easier. Course wallops its way onto Nintendo Switch June 30th. I still haven't beaten it. I have it. Is coming to the Metroid Dread Ooh. Game. Metroid Dread All free it takes update? Is one hit. Oh no. Even from this. So hit even once causes a game over in the brutal Dread Mode difficulty. Sheesh! Dread Mode. Can you face this new challenge? Okay, this is and for Elias Thompson, Metroid where are you at? <laughs> take advantage of increased recovery with the newly added rookie mode difficulty. Oh, so they added new modes. This free update launches later today. Oh boy, later today. Update in April will add I would love to see speedruns of Dread Mode. Battle bosses continuously, one at a time. Sheesh. That'll be something. Something's bound for Nintendo Switch. Uh oh, what do we have? It is Earthbound. Earthbound is coming to Nintendo Switch Online. Well, it was happening sooner or later. It was happening sooner or later. I just beat this game, too. Not that long ago. It's about damn time. Yeah, Earthbound is amazing. I actually did like this game. Uh, it's it's something like that. Yeah, Death Slayer. Explore the be. Oh, and then I guess Earthbound Beginnings are gonna. Yep. Well, now I got something to play on there also. Earthbound Beginnings. So both Earthbound games are gonna be on there. I'll ha I'll have to uh, play this one then too on stream. I didn't think they were gonna add that uh, to it, but apparently they listened. Earthbound and Earthbound Beginnings will be added to Nintendo Switch Online later today. Later today, ladies and gentlemen. I'm so happy for the people. I'm pretty hyped about this. Like, I've always wanted to play Earthbound Beginnings. I I beat Earthbound, but I never um. Like I said, I never uh, played the uh, beginnings one. I heard it's pretty difficult, but yeah, I'm super, I'm super pumped about that. A 
Okay, so they're just kind of going through all this stuff here until, like, the very end, then. Lego Brawl? I didn't even know there was a Lego Brawls. Oh, available t uh, June 2022. Okay. You're gonna, yeah. <laughs> You're eating good, man. You'll be Here's eating some good. News for Mario Kart fans. Many uh -oh. of you have been enjoying the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game since its launch in 2017. Uh-oh. So, we've been working on remastering select courses from across the Mario Kart series, oh, and we'll it's... be releasing them as paid downloadable content. It's... Please take a look at this trailer. Oh, so it's DLC for Mario Kart 8. So they have to be, like, uh, courses from, like, you know, past Mario Kart games, then. That's pretty hyped. Okay. courses will be coming to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. This is the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course. Oh, is it gonna be, like, one of those battle passes? Oh, well, I figured that. Eight courses will be released at a time over six waves. That's 48 additional courses we plan on releasing by the end of 2023. 48. Courses such as Coconut Mall. So this is kind of like a uh, a wave Chato like Not Battle Pass, but with Mario Kart. And Tokyo Blur will be included in the first wave. Of course, you can play these courses locally and online. Woohoo! The first wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe 25 bucks will launch March 18th. Oh, uh, I don't know about 25. On Nintendo I mean, it, it is dope. Don't get me wrong, but 25 bucks? At no additional cost, oh, you can actually get it for... Uh, oh, okay. Plus expansion pack membership. Okay, well, I can actually get it for free then if I have the expansion pass. pass on its own. Okay, well, I mean, at least I get to check it out for a little while. How was that? I hope you're looking forward to the additional courses in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. This next segment will be our last announcement. Oh, one more thing. All right, get ready. Brace yourselves for this one more thing. Fighting in order to live. Is this is this Xenoblade? Is this a Xenoblade? That's the way of our world. Ionios. Tell me, what would possess you to side with them? We're fighting because there are enemies to kill. I refuse to believe. I think this is Xenoblade. I knew it. I saw this coming. You are. You're not enemies now. I kind of recognize the the, uh, the sword a little bit. Try, try to move forward. Again. Twenty-five is too much. One is it ever too much? They're his few. Sword March, the land pierced by a great sword. It's the only way you're gonna defeat the real enemy. Whatever life is lost, I won't let you soldier it all alone. What good filling up these flickering crops in our eyes? Why? Well, I, I just mentioned it. I just mentioned this. Uroboros abhor this world. They must be erased with a disgrace. Yeah, there you see a lot of these games on the Switch, to be honest. Like, are games like kind of like similar? Yep, I, I knew it. Yep. I, I figured it was. So, I mean, I'm happy for the people that uh, are going to uh, 
be pre-ordered. I don't... Ooh, so that soon? Okay, well, whatever. The story of Xenoblade Chronicles 3 ties together the futures of the worlds depicted in Xenoblade okay. Chronicles and Xenoblade Chronicles 2, and it will launch this September. I hope you'll look In September. To That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Okay, well, what'd you guys think? What'd you guys think of this as, as soon as I close this out here? So let me, let me kind of close out here. What did you guys think of this entire thing? Well, how, how would you rate this so far? So let me see if I can uh, get this uh, off of here. Let me see if I can just... Uh... Okay, I'm trying to find the... Um... Why is my internet always, like, trying to... Uh, internet... Internet, hello? God, like, I can't really find it, to be honest. It's, like, in this crowd of stuff I have in here, but it's not in here. Uh, 7 out of... Yeah, I think I'd probably rate it a 7 out of 10, too, to be honest. Okay, um, let me just kind of... Well, not really, you know, not really close it out, but attempt to, uh... Okay, I can get this out of full screen. Here, let me, uh... Yeah, let me get out of here. Yeah, I, yeah, sometimes I just don't get why it does that, but, uh, especially on OBS side. Even though you're a PlayStation fan, 7.5, yeah, I was thinking, like, at least a 7, at least over here. Why the hell do I, am I having trouble finding, oh, it's right here, okay. I was like, why do I have so much trouble finding that? Okay, so, Xing that off. Um, so... I thought it was okay, personally. You know, there were some things I'm pretty hyped about. Super Strikers was obviously the, well, the Mario Strikers soccer uh, Switch game I'm pretty excited about. Um, I'm also... Oh, spare me, Rick Ashley. I wasted all of my money on OnlyFans. Ten too much anime. <laughs> Two of ten too much anime. <laughs> That's just a cheese. But yeah, the, Mar yeah, the Mario... Yeah, the Mario uh, Strikers game I was pretty ex pretty pumped about. Yeah, Earthbound, obviously, Earthbound and Earthbound Beginnings to Switch Online. That was going to happen eventually. And uh, I think everything else was okay afterwards. Um, so, yeah, that was basically it for me. You know, I'm probably going to do some editing. I'm going to kind of react to some of my favorite parts from this, and I'll put it in a video. But, um, yeah, I mean, it, it was okay. You know, it wasn't the best, but like I said, it was, it was definitely passable. You know, I mean, it's... Yeah, of course, like, you knew had the, your fire emblems, you had your Xenoblades, you had everything else kind of going there, your RPGs and all that. But that was kind of expected, to be honest. But I didn't expect any Breath of the Wild 2 uh, updates to kind of happen. i kind of bummed that there's no Donkey Kong game, new Donkey Kong game releasing. But, you know, that's, you know, it's whatever. And, yeah, that was pretty much my thoughts on it. So, um... That being said, we are going to raid somebody in the meantime. That's because, like I said, I still got, I got some things. I got to clean up some things, and then I got to uh, start editing this stuff here also as well. Uh, let me see who's online. We can raid. See if there's anybody on. Um, the Demon Slayer. Go well, yeah, I know you like that sort of thing. 